Hello everybody, my name is Benizer. I know, I know, shut up. It's been a while. It's been about two weeks. Two, two, yeah. Yeah, pretty much. It's been about two weeks since I've done a card opening video. Shut up, get out of the comments. <laughs> but in this video, um, I, I know this is like long, I mean, it's not long past. It's only about a couple weeks past, but, uh, I finally got this. The, uh, wow, that's, uh, it's the, uh, Duskmane Necrozma GX, uh, tin. Uh, so yeah, I found it, and there better be some good stuff in here because I freaking spent 20 bucks on it. It's, let's see what we got. We have ourselves this beautiful, oh my god, I find it so difficult to get this part out. Ah, crap, I'm bending it. Why do I find it so difficult to get this part out? Oh my god. We got the Duskmane Necrozma GX card. Obviously, you can't play it because it's a promo, but... It's good. I also bought this tin because I found myself in need of a tin. I run out of tins. So, just like every other, there's four packs. We have an Ultra Prism, a Crimson Invasion, a Steam Siege, and a Fates Collide. So, I'm going to open up from my least favorite to my most favorite. So, least favorite up to most favorite. Definitely in this order. Alright, we're going to open up my least favorite right here right now. Steam Siege. I mean, Steam Siege, don't get me wrong, it's it's a good pack, I guess, but not really. <laughs> not really compared to, like, every other pack that came out during X and Y. Yeah, you guys are going to see the top card, blah, blah, blah. Oh, wait, can't show you the code card, because doing the giveaway, everybody, remember, comment down below, uh, whatever, something, anything. Any comment could get thrown in, even if you don't want it. What is it? This is X and Y, so it's three to the front. Uh, wow, excuse me, lights, why did you turn off? <laughs> Sorry about that, <laughs> my lights just turned off for no reason. So, through the front, we already did the card trick. Uh, Steelix, Spirit Link, Nidorino, Anarith, Clauncher. That is not an uncommon, I thought that was a diamond. Bergmite, Chimchar, Yanma, Mary. Reverse Hollow Mary, that is cool. And last card is, whoa, Gardevoir EX. That's, oh man, I haven't pulled like a EX in such a long time because Sun and Moon is starting to do the GX things. Look at that. Look how sexy that is. Mmm. Smexy, gonna uh, sleeve that later on. Don't have my sleeves on me right now. doodle a doo Go put the pile right there. All right. Let's go on to Crimson Invasion. I don't really like Crimson Invasion that much. If it came down to Crimson Invasion, Burning Shadows, and Ultra Prism, and Base Set, I would definitely choose this last. Ultra Prism would be my first, then it would be Base Set, then I'd choose uh, Burning Shadows, and then Crimson Invasion. I don't like Crimson Invasion that much. I know, I'm ripping up the pack. I know a lot of you are going to be like, oh my god, I'm so lucky this code card wasn't backwards. <laughs> Otherwise, you guys would have gotten it. And you know, I'm doing my giveaway, so I don't really want it. This is for the front, because it's on the moon. I don't really want it. Wait, this is... This was Crimson Invasion, right? Yeah, okay. Alright, uh, yeah, I already did the card trick. I don't know, I'm loopy. Okay, Fairy Energy. Dang it, I forgot to do the, uh, the trademarked... I mean, not by me. It's not trademarked by me. If you know who it's trademarked by, then good luck for... Er, good luck. Good for you, the energy. Hakamo-o. Sea of Nothingness. Whoa. Diggersby, Aaron, Ghastly, Staryu, Cacnea, Stuffle. Oh, that's a cute card. Reverse Hollow Psychic Memory, and blah! And a Wigglytuff. That is a... I mean, it's it's not like an EX or GX, but I guess it's good because it's a... I don't know, I kind of like Wigglytuff. Ah, I'm that kind of person. Yep. Yeah. All right. Putting that in a pile over there. So far, Gardevoir EX is the best one we've gotten. Fates Collide is one... It's not my favorite pack of X and Y, but it's it's up there. I kind of like it. <clears throat> After all, like, the legendaries and stuff that are in it. Come on. I'm trying not to bend the cards because... Oh, God, this pack is so hard to open. Why are you being so difficult? Why must you be so difficult? I despise you. Okay. Uh, is this, hang on, I gotta, okay, this code card's backwards, so you guys are gonna get it. <clears throat> Make sure you guys don't get it. Uh, three to the front, because this is 
X and Y. La la leader Lou. We got Altaria Spirit Link. We got Dome Fossil Kabu K Kabuto. Kabuto. Halucha. Larvitar. Bronzor. Mincino. Oh. Snubble. <clears throat> Deerling. Oh, I've never gotten a Kabuto out of this set. It's a reverse Hollow Kabuto. And that goes good with the, uh. That goes good with, um. Uh, it's so hard to do this. Uh. Dome Fossil Kabuto. Look at bottom seven cards. You're dead. All right. And final card is an Oma Star. Oh, that's cool. I got two fossil Pokemon out of this. That's cool. That's actually a really playable card in the card game. <clears throat> I might be doing streams over the summer of me uh, playing people. You know what I mean? Oops, camera moved a little bit since the beginning. All right, and now to the, my favorite pack out of all of these. Might even be my favorite pack in all of Pokemon. I don't know why, but Ultra Prism is just, it's its good. I like it a lot. I'm going to try not to rip this because this, this is a lot of people's favorite pack. So I'm going to try not to rip this so I can like save it for like later on. Oh. <laughs> I'm trying my best not to... Not the ru and I ruined it right there. The paint came off. Dang. You know what? I'll, I'll still try. Maybe people won't, won't really care. And then I'll just take the cards out of the top. Hang on. Eh. Trying to take the cards out of the top really, really smoothly. It's quite difficult. Eh. Eh. Okay, I got it out. Uh, one, two, three, four to the front. I don't do the four and then these two. I don't do that. I just do four to the front. I found it a lot better. Dang it, I forgot to do the guess the energy. Uh, water type. Water type is my favorite. Cosmoem. I'm not a playable card at all. <laughs> Volkner. Uh, Brazong. Carnivine. Bunnery. Passimian. Chimchar. Uh, Lickitung. Ooh, reverse hello Obama snow. That's already a star. That's already super cool. That's nice. Not a really playable card. You gotta use four energy for eighty. Is now asleep. Oh, that actually might that's actually good. I wouldn't I personally wouldn't play it, but I mean like I don't do stuff like uh your Pokemon is not paralyzed or sleep. I'm just more of a all out battle kind of person. I don't really put Pokemon asleep. Especially in like the games. I usually get rid of stuff like Tail Whip and those kinds of attacks. I usually keep the fighting attacks. Anyways, time for the final card is... Ah! Is, uh, Shenotic. Okay, well, at least we got that Gardevoir EX. Uh, we got the Obama Snow as our Reverse Hollow. We got... Hang on, grabbing the other cards. Huh. We got... Blah, we got the Kabuto. We got the Oma Star, which I really like. We got, what else we got? We got the Larvitar. We got the Wigglytuff. Psychic Memory, don't really care about that, though. Um, We got the Mary, which is really cool. What else is there? Um, I think that's pretty much it. Those are the good cards we got. <clears throat> don't forget, uh, I'm doing the code card giveaway. Pretty much any comment from my videos will be going into the giveaway. Look at that, Gardevoir EX. That is a really playable card. Look at that. Luminous Blade. It's only three energy. Discard an energy. Oh, it is a discard this energy. But, I mean, I I guess it's... Well, that that is definitely useful. Link, bat, link Blast. If Pokemon your opponent active Pokemon. Blah, 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 blah. The 70 more damage. So, if the other Pokemon has two energies, if I'm reading this right, which I'm reading it really fast. <laughs> uh, this does 100 damage if they have two energies. This is a really, really playable card. I like this. I will definitely be using this at tournaments and stuff. It also does look a little bent. I'll just have, Whoa, that is really bent. I didn't do that while taking it out. It was in the pack. Because I'm really careful when I open up cards to not bend them. I mean, <laughs> even though at the beginning you saw me, like, bending the GX card. But, yeah, whatever. It was an accident. Um, so, yeah. I'll definitely be, like, probably sleeving this, putting it in... I don't know, putting it in my binder and then putting something heavy on top of it or something. Or I'll put it in a sleeve and I'll put it in between a book. I'll find a way to flatten this out so it's not all bent up. So yeah, this is the card we got. Um, well, I guess this is going to be the end of this video. 
If you liked it, hit the like button as hard as possible. Share with your friends and family. Share some lives with your friends and family. Subscribe after you subscribe. Hit that bell icon to get notified whenever I make a video or stream. Because I do both all the time. And this card is lovely. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!